Hello everybody! Welcome to this week's episode of Cooking Out Loud, all about the seafood boil. Uh, listen, this episode was inspired by my recent trip to Miami, where I got to take a plane ride and see some awesome views of Miami and the surrounding areas. I take a look whilst I uh, go and gather some more ingredients. <laughs> Miami Beach, Florida, a spring break destination. <laughs> I was super excited to be in Miami Beach, but mostly because I got to meet up with one of my very best friends, Captain Ash Slaughter, who took me up in the Cessna. After a few safety checks to ensure the plane was ready for flying, it was time for takeoff. One of my favorite parts about this entire trip was getting to fly the plane by myself for a few minutes. <laughs> It's time for the seafood boil. All right, I'm so excited. Uh, the non-seafood items you want to gather is an orange, a couple of lemons. I have these uh, dried red chiles that I kind of polarized with a little bit of uh, olive oil and salt in this uh, mortar and pestle here. And I've got some red potatoes, some white onions, some corn, garlic, and this seafood boil seasoning that I really like called Slap Your Mama. I wouldn't recommend you slapping your mama. Um, that might not end so well for you, but <laughs> this is delicious, okay? And then of course the proteins are going to be some Cajun sausage. I've got some delicious crab here, uh, lobster tails, clams, and shrimp. So the seafood boil is not that complicated. In fact, it's pretty simple. It really just boils down to the timing in which you put everything in the pot because some things take a little longer to cook than others. It'll be easy. Watch this. To your big old stock pot, you're going to add 10 cups of water along with two cups of seafood stock. If you can't find seafood stock at your local market, that's fine. Chicken stock works out just fine. All right, to add some seasoning to the water, let's add the juice and flesh of a whole orange along with the juice and flesh of two whole lemons. Along with that, you're gonna slice those white onions and throw those in the water as well, right before you add your seasoning packet. The Slap Your Mama seasoning is delicious, but only add half of that pack to the water. Reserve the rest of it to sprinkle over the seafood later on. Don't forget to add those red chilies if you like an added spicy kick to your seafood boil. We boil that down for about five minutes before we add our potatoes first. Give those potatoes an eight minute head start before you add your <laughs> lobster tails. 
After about five more minutes, you want to go ahead and add the clams. The crab. <laughs> and the yellow corn. Give that mixture a stir. Cover that pot with a lid and let that simmer on for about five more minutes. The very last thing you're going to add to this water is the Cajun sausage and that delicious shrimp. Those two don't take long to cook at all. The Cajun sausage is essentially, you know, par cooked and the shrimp only take about a couple of minutes really. Once those are in the pot, let that boil for a couple of minutes, give that a stir and then turn the heat off. Oh my goodness, would you look at that? But we ain't done yet. I reserved about a cup and a half of the broth from the pan and mixed it with two tablespoons of butter to pour over that seafood. And then we're gonna sprinkle this seasoning right over this. Oh. And let that steam. Well, there you have it, the seafood boil. Oh, look what I got. I got a little shrimp. I had to taste it. You guys know that I have a taste tested because how do you know if it tastes good unless you taste it? Oh, oh, oh. Oh, y'all. We about to chow down on this, okay? Listen. Seafood boil it your way at home. I like crab. You can do the same exact thing with crawfish. You can do the same exact thing with any seafood that can be boiled. Have at it. I'm excited for you guys to try it. Let me know what you think. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel so you guys can keep up with what we have coming up next. I've got some awesome recipes that I can't wait to try out with you guys. Till next time, boil on. Dana, 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 Dana. Oh, look at the lens got all fogged up. You ready to eat that? <laughs>